Check the drip. Check the drip. Check the drip. Check the drip. Check the drip out. That's right, Bobby. Yeah, yeah. So, y'all, I'm going to talk about some is today, you heard? Facts. You know what I mean? So, in a few, in a few seconds, a few minutes, I'm going to show y'all some clips. Some clips of, um, of some weird, spooky things that I came across on the internet. Weird spooky things that I came across on the internet. You know what I mean? Really weird. Keep that tarantula up there. Look, so it's the night before Halloween and all through the house. Not a finger was licking, not even a mouse. Yo, check it. Check it. A hundred, a hundred on the wrist. Not a hundred K, just a hundred. <laughs> Just kidding. Check this, yo, check this crib out. This crib look crazy. Facts. You know what I mean? That's what I call about ornaments. Facts. Check it out. I'm going to take you all the way. All the way, son. Facts. Look. You know what I mean? Ah! Check this out, son. Ah! Check this joint out. This joint is funky. Funky fresh. Ah! Joint is funky fresh. Oh. Ah. Funky fresh. Ah! Check it out, son. Ah! Check it out, kid. It goes all the way to here. Ah! Funky, funky, fresh. Word, son. Word. Yo, so anyway, there's some stuff I found on the internet, you know what I mean? About, about, um, artists that do rituals and stuff like that. And I'm going I'm to I'm show y'all the clips. I'm going to play y'all the clips. The little clips and the few. I, but it's, it gets real deep. You know what I mean? About the, about, about the rituals. And I got proof that real artists, entertainers, entertainers be going to do rituals and stuff like that for their family members and stuff like that. You know what I mean? Like they go to real witches and people that do that type of stuff. You dig? You know what I mean? Little Halloween treat for y'all. Stay, stay tuned, son. Facts! Hey, what up? It's your boy Hack to the Tech to the Get That Check. So like I said, today I was going to talk about... um. You know the the ritualistic world and how uh, you know um I've been seeing these vi these videos online like from uncensored uh, hip hop dot com and and you know uh, Mav Hoffa he be asking people about um you know have they ever seen anything any type of rituals going on and stuff like that well I got well. If y'all haven't heard of this man, you know what I'm saying? A lot of y'all have. His name is John Ramirez. Um, this man used to be um um he was a a, a, a ex Satan worshiper. Um he used to do work for the devil. He um he used to do mad things and um um one part that uh that I do that I do know that kinda um well the whole video I'll put the link on the thing if you haven't seen it. I'm sure a lot of y'all seen it because this video has like seven million 
views or whatever, but there's a part where he says that. I'll just play it for y'all. Check it out. You know what I mean? Let me play it for y'all. You know what I mean? For the five clubs or five lounges a night to look for people to recruit to the dark side. I would tell people their fortune. I would tell people their lives. I would tell people things that they did, things that was going to happen to them. That then they had no clue who I was. They didn't know who I was. I just had the demonic powers. I had a taste for blood. I would, I would kill animals and drink the blood every week. I will, if I didn't have money to, if I didn't have time to buy an animal, I would cut myself and drink my own blood. The ring of, 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 of the people that I was with that was in this demonic world, doctors, lawyers, uh, principals, judges, police officers, they were all into witchcraft. There was all, even singers today that are very well known. I put them, I, I would move principalities on that region to control uh, demons on the ground to operate, to, church, to cut down the church, to cut down the, the, the growth of the church to cut down the, 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 the opportunity for people to get saved. I would will, I will be drunk, I'd come out of a club and I would have demon possessed, drunk, I would stand in the middle of the street and say, God, come down, you want some of this? So you heard, you heard him say that even singers today, very well known singers today, he used to do rituals for and, and help him out and everything. And also, I got another one Another video of this kid that did the same thing. Um, and you're going to be surprised when you hear this one if you haven't seen it yet. You know what I mean? You're going to be surprised when you, when you see what my man talking about right here. You know what I mean? Um, hey, are you okay in there? You know yeah, I mean? don't worry about me. My Facts. stomach just hurts. Oh, we can go home if you want. I know you're going to... Be surprised when you hear this one. You know what I mean? This kid, this kid did the same thing. You know what I mean? And he mentioned somebody very well known, and that are people are always asking about this family if they do ritualistic things and this kid let it be known right here and and it's crazy what he says i'll just play it for y'all you know what i mean check it out so because they're telling me things like hey so you're you're called to be a warlock you're called to be a you're called to be a dual inducted warlock and this is your ancestors and and and, and your great grandmother was a witch and, and they tell you all these things just to like to get you to believe this because they want the devil wants to use you right. especially when he sees the gifts on your life then the call on your life the demons know before even we do because they can see in the spirit realm so anyways i'm i'm seeking i'm seeking i went to new orleans and this is when it got even realer i went to a, a warlock out there in new orleans and he was training me up because I met him. He said, you know, he said the same thing that all the other ones said and said, I need to train you. I'm the one that's called to train you, a Puerto Rican guy. And I literally, as he's saying these things and I'm learning from him different things, Solange Knowles walks in, Beyonce's sister, into that little, it's called the Botanica, the little witchcraft store. Solange Knowles, Beyonce's sister walks in with her boyfriend and I'm like, Am I, is this a dream? And I'm, is this Solange Knowles? He's like, yeah, she comes here regularly. We do rituals for her and her family. And I'm just like, what? Like the nose, you, like, yeah, man, this is real. And she's buying product and, and paying for rituals. And I'm like, this might be my call. This, this might be my purpose. This might be it. Because again, I'm seeking the purpose of life. That's the root to all of this. Is the what's the purpose of life? So you heard that. You saw that for yourself. You know what I mean? I ain't gotta explain much more. I put the link to his video underneath the description. You know what I'm saying? So that's my little Halloween video for today. Hope y'all enjoyed it. It's your boy Heck to the tech to the get that check. Where's my candy at? Huh? Damn. Facts. Go follow me on TikTok. Follow me on Instagram. Follow me on all social media platforms, boy. I. I got a song out there featuring my boy Vigilante. And well, his, his song, I'm featured on his song, just came out. You know what I mean? And there's a lot of hip-hop out there. You know what I mean? Facts.
Peace to everybody watching. Have a safe and uh, Halloween. You know what I mean? Facts. Peace. One to the two to the three to the four. Snoop Doggy Dog and Dr. Dre is at your door. Facts.